I have so many things to do, so many things at home. Today, I will go for a hike in Austria to a place called Hochlunch. Let me show you this area. I'm not sure you can see, but the bad weather is coming. It's Saturday in September. The summer is ending and the nights are getting cold and the weather gets a bit tricky. No rain was forecasted for today, but it's kind of a smell of a rain. I had a two weeks vacation and I've been to Croatia and last week I was already working and this weekend looked very far on Monday. It was a long, long working week and I believe I deserved the weekend. I drove maybe an hour from my home to get here to Teicham, to Teichamsee, and I will go to Hochlunch, which is at this moment under the clouds. Not promising at all, not promising. And I tried to reach some friends. They were very positive to join during the week. But then on the day, on the day of action, no, 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 no. Maybe next week. I believe I'm not a next week guy. So I just came here to have some exercise. It's also getting cold, but I have warm clothes and rain jacket, but I still don't want to wear. Uh, it's still the middle of September. I don't like to wear winter jacket in the rain. The parking lots were full when I started, but here on the way I didn't meet so many people. It's kind of a weird because it's a prime time for the hike. And maybe they have better weather forecast than I do. To go alone for a hike, not necessarily good or bad, but it's very different when I'm not alone. When I'm alone, normally I choose some known path because I don't want to deal with problems like being lost or something like that. This ibex was very friendly. It's good to see animals in the nature as long as they don't want to eat you.
met the second Ibex. That was very nice. I'm very close to the peak, but the weather is getting gloomier and gloomier, if this word exists. But still, going up, going up. Being here alone in the wood makes me feel like I'm a hero. Hero against the fog. The peak is nearly visible. I mean, I can see, but I don't think it's visible in the footage. I am at the top. Basically, I cannot see anything. I am in the clouds. The goal is achieved. I go back. I have so many things to do. So many things at home. At least the sun is trying, trying hard. I'm going down already and the stones are very slippery. I had a small accident, nothing serious. My camera battery doesn't like this cold weather. It's getting flat faster. It took two hours to get to the peak and one hour to go down again. It looks really amazing. And I am back. It was three and a half hours. I really enjoyed it. It was nice to meet my old Ibex friends. And at the end, the sun is shining. It's about the sunset time. <laughs> <laughs>